My name is John Chartier, I'm designer of the Anthem Viper. Yes, yeah, so I think with the Viper, we wanted to go to that direction that a lot of the off-road wheels were going with the full face design. Um, kind of looks like a turbine, um, so that's where the uh, Viper came from. It's off of uh, one of the military fighter jets. I know Dave um, kind of, I think, came up with that name and fits it perfectly. And. Uh, yeah, I mean, there's not much to say. It's it's a bold it's a bold design somewhere that we've never went with Anthem, and I think I think it turned out the way we wanted it to. And I think for for this wheel, it's one of my favorite wheels that I've designed because I got to get a little bit more bold with the design and get away from like you know the multi-spoke wheel. I mean, we do a lot of that stuff, and obviously for a reason because it's it's they're popular and they're they're clean. But I think with this one, it was. It was nice to be able to uh, go outside that comfort zone and come up with a, a different design that you know we've, we've never done before. So, and I I liked it yeah so much as I was designing it that I knew right away I was like yeah I'm definitely gonna run those on my personal truck. I think it just fits that off road you know simple, not too extreme. Um, it goes with a lot of a lot of builds. I think the Jeep the Jeep guys will really like it as well. For this one, we'll be doing the 17s, 18s, 20s, um, available in gloss black and satin black. Um, I think we wanted to do a, a gloss for the uh, guys that want to show their vehicles. Yeah, I think pretty simple with this one. Um, no milling, just uh, straight up uh, gloss and satin black. Yeah, I think the inspiration for this wheel was um, actually some of the, the car wheels with the, the smaller windows and I uh, just kind of went with it. You know, it, it, it kind of took shape right away. I changed, uh, I took some of the heaviness out of the wheel um, as I went. It just was too blocky it's just to make it not so heavy because it's obviously a heavy full face wheel as it is and I just wanted to give it some character. So yeah, I think I made a few tweaks along the way but it came together pretty, pretty quickly so worked out well. Hopefully y'all uh, enjoy it.